All right, Tony and Alex here taking a look at another Big Bang movement, uh, one of our favorites, and that is our rotational lunge using the sandbag. Learning this from the ultimate sandbag guys over at DVRT. Um, the reason why this, this exercise is, is a Big Bang movement is because our body will be moving in one plane of motion while the load will be moving in a different plane of motion. So the stability of the load is huge. It goes through the roof, all right? So Alex is going to break this down for us a little bit. So we're going to step back into a reverse lunge, right? And at the same time, that bag is going to rotate over the leg that's out in front, just like so. Then we stand back up. Keep the bag nice and close as we get used to this. Alternate to the other side. Okay, good. Relax. So as you can see there, the body goes in one plane. The, the load's moving in this plane of motion. The frontal, I can make an argument for a transverse plane as well. So one more time. As we load it up, keep it close to the body. Now I'm going to have him go through these a couple of times. Keep going as we alternate each side. Now you're when you're ready to intensify this, now we just swing the bag away from the body. So now the bag comes up and away from the body, goes to the other side, coming up like that. So another reason why this is such a, go ahead and relax, such a huge big bang motion is that, yeah, we're working the lunge pattern, but we're also hitting the hip pattern as well, or the hip hinge pattern. So we're, we're targeting both quads, hips, all at the same time, at the, and then big time stability with the core and uh, stabilizing the spine, all right? So again, big bang movement here is your rotational sandbag. Uh, a good rep range there is about eight, eight to 10 on each side. Uh, we'll definitely do the job. Go get after it.